Welcome to YNU 540, coming to you from the campus of Yokohama National University, here in Yokohama, Japan's second city. My name is Alec Macaulay. This is a broadcast for English language learners here in Japan and overseas. On the show, guests come in and talk about five photos that are important to them. Today I am with Rik here in a wet Tokyo.、Uh, Rik is French Japanese. Hi, Rik. Hi.、Uh, how are you? Fine, thank you. Now, you're Japanese, but you've lived in France for a long time. You have five photos from Paris today, yeah? Yes. Why were you in Paris? I was in Paris、um, for my university studies.、Mm-hmm. And, and I went there because I was in French school in Tokyo. Now, how long did you stay in the French education system in Tokyo?、And、since kindergarten, so more than 15 years. Right, so you've had all your education in French. That's right. Right. So are you French or Japanese?、Um, both. <laughs> mm-hmm. Both. Right. And this first photo is from your time in Paris, yeah? Yes.、Mm-hmm. And tell us about the photo. So this is in the middle of Paris,、um, along the Seine River. I was having a walk with、um, a friend, a childhood friend, a girl.、Mm-hmm. Her name is.、Um, Whose name is you?、And、this is the girl we see in the picture, yeah? Yes. This is a black and white photo, but she really wears a black、right. wear,、mm-hmm. cloth.、Um, and all your photos are black and white. Why is that?、Um, because、um, black and white is, I think it's more beautiful than color photos. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's dramatic. Right. It's、um, unreal.、Mm. And it's.、Um, Artistic, right? Yeah, all your photos are very artistic. So you obviously、uh, were very interested in photography at one time.、Uh, yes, I. The first time I took a picture with my photo, my camera was when I was fifteen,、mm-hmm. and I went to Paris when I was eighteen. Right. And I take many, many, many pictures there.、Mm-hmm. Okay, <coughs> and do you still keep up your interest in photography now?、Um, I had、um, a blank when I came back to Japan about ten or twelve years ago. Right. I stopped taking photos because Tokyo is less interesting than Paris to mm. take photos. Mm. Okay, let's move on to your next photo. Photo number two. This is still in the middle of Paris. I don't remember. The、um, precisely where it was, I think it was in a place named Le Marais.、Mm-hmm. And、uh, what you see is a boy c-、um, coming back from school, I think.、Mm-hmm. And it's hard to see, maybe, but in the、um, the big window, right, there is a picture of a bird.、Mm. And it's a copy of、um, a painting of Magritte, René Magritte. Is this near where you lived in Paris? No, I was not living in the middle of the town, but、um, in the suburbs.、Mm. What I like about this photo is, is the the wall, the erosion and the dents in the wall and the different grey and white and black you have in the wall. I didn't really think when I took took the picture. It's just inspiration. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, tell us about the next photo. So we are back again in the middle of Paris, along the riv- Seine River.、Mm-hmm. It was a popular、um, scene、mm-hmm. you could see there,、um, a man and woman. Right. You must have been far away when you took this photo. Yes, I took this with、um, a zoom. And this scene,、um, couples kissing along the River Seine, of course, is very traditional, very symbolic of Paris. Yes. Did you see this many times during your time there?、Um, not many times, but sometimes. And when were you in Paris? I was in Paris from 1988 to、um, 1995. Because I read recently that you don't see this so much these days.、Uh, maybe not. Maybe it has disappeared. Mm. But it's a very romantic scene, very Parisian scene. Yes.、Uh, I hope it hasn't disappeared. That would be a shame. <laughs> Did you ever、uh, kiss a girl along the river Seine yourself? 
Of course I did. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're giving me the let's move on sign, so let's <laughs> go to the next photo. <laughs> so this, I don't remember where it, where it was, but it's still in Paris. Mm -hmm. um, it's a photo of a girl, which was watching, looking at um, a street performer. Mm. Do you remember what the street performer was doing? Uh, not really. Because she has a very intense look on her face. Yes. Mm. But I really don't remember what was doing the street performer. Right. And the doll is interesting. Yes, because it's a big doll of a baby. Mm. And you don't see that oftenly now. You don't see those kind of dolls very much these days. No, we don't. Mm. And at first I thought this was a real baby when I first saw it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and do you remember which part of Paris this was? Um, it's in the middle of Paris. Mm. And I know recently you visited Paris with your daughter. Yes. And Paris has a reputation as being a city not very friendly towards children. Not a good place to visit for children. Did you find that? Um, it's Yes, it's difficult to find um, attractions for children, mm -hmm. but it does exist. Mm. And I, yes, I, I bought a book. The title was um, The Wednesday of the Little Parisians. Okay. Um, because the Wednesday is... Um, in many schools, is um, a holiday for um, for children. Okay, and this is a French book. Yeah? Yes, and um, in this book, you have many attractions, many things to s to do mm -hmm. uh, for children. So, what did you do with your daughter in Paris? Uh, I went uh, in the museum, mm -hmm. and there was a workshop for little children. Ah, okay. What kind of things did they do in the workshop? Painting. Oh, okay. And she enjoyed that? Yeah. Well, that sounds great. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the next one? <coughs> is the last one. Um, this is near where I was living, in Neuilly-sur-Seine. Uh, I was working with my friend. Um, and you see the his back on the photo. Oh, on the right of the photo. On the right, yeah. And we crossed um, a group of four men mm -hmm. and I wanted to take a picture of them mm. so one of them begins to move um, comically yeah and the others were laughing yeah this is my favorite of your five photos that the expressions on their faces are <laughs> yes. priceless yeah, yeah. And these were just four guys you saw on the street, yeah? Yes. Why did you decide to photograph them? Um, I don't know. There was, um, you know, a black man mm. and, and man coming from the south of Europe. You know, it was um, multi-ethnic. Right. So I thought it was interesting. Mm. And this is the 1990s, right? 19 about around 1990. I don't know if it's the fashion or because it's in black and white, but it kind of looks 1960s to me. <laughs> yeah, mm. it's very atmospheric. That's I really like this photo. That's maybe the reason I took a picture of them. Mm. Mm. And I know you're thinking perhaps of becoming a French citizen. Mm, I would like to. Yeah. yeah. Why do you want to become French? Because I feel myself more French than Japanese. Mm, well, you've been educated in France and yeah. your your mother tongue is French, yeah? Yes. Yeah. So do you think you will give up your Japanese citizenship and become French? The problem is that I don't want to give up my Japanese citizenship. And you can't have dual nationality? <laughs> you are. In Japan, no. No, okay. Well, good luck with that decision. Thank you. Thanks.